with Skiff dead and his murderers, the thieves, getting away on a barge with the stolen plans for the car, Thomas, Sonny, and Captain set out on a raft to find the thieves and finally clear their names. When they first set out, there wasn't much talking, but eventually boredom overtook them, and Captain piped up. Say, uh, I never caught you guys' names, he said. Oh, I'm T- Uh, said Thomas, forgetting for a moment that he was still in disguise and a fugitive. I'm, uh, Bridlington. Yes, Bridlington, said Thomas, quickly thinking of the goods yard. Yes, and, and I'm, uh, York, said Sonny, taking the same idea as Thomas, both of them knowing that Captain would have no knowledge of railway goods yards on the mainland. Funny names. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't talk, though. My name's Captain, you know, like Captain of a Boat. But I am the boat. <laughs> eh, it's not that funny. Sonny and Thomas just kind of looked at each other. Not really long what to say next. If you don't mind me asking, said Captain, what business do you two have with these thieves? I mean, obviously you're chasing them and all, but last I heard they were being chased by or helped by Thomas the Tank Engine and some other engine. I mean, you two don't seem like the thieving type to me. Well, said Thomas, it's kind of a complicated story. But basically, those thieves have something we want, as you've probably guessed. And well, if we find that thing, hopefully it'll make our lives better. A, so I mean, York. Uh, yes, Bridlington. Yes, uh... Hopefully it will. So, uh, Captain, said Thomas, do you have any idea as to where we're going? Well, that's the thing, I had sight of the thieves a little while ago, but uh, now they're gone. Although I think I might have an idea as to where they'd be. Oh, said Thomas, uh, where? Well, said Captain, they had a bit of garbage on that barge. I suspect they're going to miss the island. Misty Island, said Thomas. Yeah, Misty Island. Haven't you heard of the place? Well, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I've, I've been a couple of times, said Thomas. Oh, well, basically over the years, they've kind of turned it into an extra garbage dump. The place Whiff works at couldn't handle the load anymore. And Misty Island doesn't really do a whole lot for the Northwestern. So now it's just kind of a trash heap, like it was beforehand. Oh, said Thomas. Sonny whispered to Thomas. What does this mean? Said Sonny. It means you better hold on tight, because Misty Island is one heck of a place. I thought that old barge was heading to the mainland, said Sonny. Well, yeah, most of them do, said Captain, but they stopped to dump all the old garbage on Misty Island, because, you know, it's a dump. Oh, said Sonny. That was the end of that. Well, if we're headed for Misty Island, said Captain, I suggest you two get some sleep. You see, for the railway line and the bigger ocean liners, it's uh, a bit of a faster trip, but for us smaller vessels, <laughs> it's, uh, it ain't that short. Alrighty then, said Thomas and Sonny. And they closed their eyes and drifted to sleep as the waves and Captain carried them to Misty Island. As night fell and the engines began drifting off to sleep, Captain began talking to his captain about what he thought of all this. This doesn't make sense to me, said Captain. Literally every engine, whether Northwestern or British Rail or whatever, knows about Misty Island. Ever since Thomas the Tank... Thomas the Tank Engine. You better not say anything about this, Captain. We don't know for sure. Uh, yes, sir said Captain to his captain. This is all so unsettling. Do you think Thomas is really a fugitive? Again, I don't know, so let's just keep this to ourselves. All right, at least till we get to Misty Island and we see what their true intentions are. Soon the dawn broke and the trio came upon Misty Island. All right, said Captain, hang on. We're going in. With Captain's help, the engines found a dock, said their goodbyes, and puffed onto dry land.
As Thomas and Sonny puffed through the heartland of Misty Island, they began to talk. All right, said Thomas. Here's the plan. We gotta find these three logging engines named Bash, Dash, and Ferdinand. They're old friends of mine. Hopefully they'll be able to help us out. Uh, right, said Sonny. Still not too sure about all this. And it was then, after about four hours of traveling Misty Island, they found it. The prestigious and still working Misty Island Logging Camp. Eureka! shouted Thomas. We found it! And he blew his whistle loud for almost the whole island to hear. Peep, peep! Sonny was so amazed he wished, and the scrap blew iron off his funnel. Then from the shadows came a rowl, and a bump, and a shake. And there they came. Bash. Dash. And Ferdinand. Bash, Dash, Ferdinand, said Thomas. It's so good to see you. That's right. Who are you, anyway? said Bash. Oh, sorry, said Thomas. Uh, sorry about the disguise. Yeah, it's, it's me, Thomas. Thomas the Tank Engine. And this is my friend, Sonny. Uh, hello, said Sonny. Thomas the Tank Engine, eh? said Dash. How interesting, isn't it, Bash? Yes, it is very interesting. That's right. What do you mean? Well, you see, Thomas, said Bash, you're what we call around here a bona fide fugitive. And seeing as how the Sodor engines hate us, dump garbage on our island, and you stop coming to see us, I think it will be great revenge and a boost for us if we turn you in. Isn't that right, Dash? Yes, isn't that right, Ferdinand? That's right. What? 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 what this makes no sense. I... Right. Come on, Dash. And Ferdinand. Let's get him. And they raced off. And that's exactly what they did with Bash and Dash hot on their tails. Come on, Ferdinand, they yelled. <sighs> Ferdinand panted from behind. That's not right. The further they went, the more dire the situation got. There's got to be another way off this damn island, said Sonny. Uh, uh, oh, said Thomas. I know, the Misty Island Tunnel. We have to go back around to the lumber yards, but we can make it, I'm sure. You better be right about this, Thomas, said Sonny. It may be our last chance. It's our only chance, said Thomas. The chase with the logging logos dragged on for a little while longer, but soon they got to the tunnel. All right, Sonny, said Thomas. See you on the other side. Same to you, my friend. And with that, they raced into the tunnel. <laughs>